for how to install fabric mods today. First step, you're gonna wanna download Minecraft. Minecraft.net, get Minecraft. <clears throat> Here, here, $29.99. I'll cut all this out, you know, this won't be in the video as, as long as I don't forget. Hello everyone. Today I'm gonna show you how to install mods for the Doug Doug server server. So first step is you're gonna want Minecraft, of course. So the first step is just launch Minecraft and make sure you ran the version of Minecraft that you wanna install this for. For me, it's 1.20.4. And as you can see, Minecraft works just fine. Our next step is to go to the fabric link below. You're gonna hit download for Windows and that's gonna download the launcher. Next step is you're gonna want to download Simple Voice Chat from the link below. You want the 1.20.4 version. Some additional things you can install while you're at it is Mod Menu. This just tells you what you have installed in Fabric. It's very useful. And then also I'm gonna install Sodium and Iris. These are essentially just performance modifications and shaders. All right. Once we have all those downloaded, we see Voice Chat Fabric, Mod Menu, Iris, and Sodium. We're gonna launch the Fabric installer first. Make sure you have 1.20, the loader version is latest, and create profile on. Okay, now we gotta find our Minecraft folder. And how we're gonna do that, is we're gonna do percent app data, percent. And this is gonna lead us into dot Minecraft. And then in here, your folder might not look like mine because mine's old as hell. First, we're gonna go wanna go to the mods and we're gonna drag in all of these mods we just downloaded, just like that. Then we can go to versions and make sure fabric installed. And now let's go to Minecraft. Okay. We can see fabric is selected down here in the install selection. All right, now that we're in the game, we can go to mods and see that Iris, Mod Menu, Simple Voice Chat, and Sodium are all successfully installed. We can even use Mod Menu to configure Voice Chat to how we want it. So since I use a Wavelink microphone, I can select Stream and Speaker to Voice Chat. And there, I'm all set. I hope you all enjoyed this tutorial and have a great day.